Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a full jumbo case of 2019 Bowman Draft Baseball. Pick your team number four. Big thanks to all of these folks for getting into it. There you go. Thanks. We are getting new toner. Don't worry about it, folks. Brian with Last Spot Mojo Padre. Get your knife. And this one. There you have it. Boom. Obsidian sold out. No, John's saying he knocked off some Obsidian. I don't know if it's sold out, though. We're trying to figure out the last hour of the broadcast, folks. Could be Obsidian. I don't know how long Obsidian is. Half, 20 minutes? 30 minutes? Yeah. No There's one left in the number block. All right, so Obsidian might be our last, the last break of the night. Maybe we might be able to squeeze in something else, depending on how long that Obsidian takes. Maybe. All right. Big thanks to Nick for taking care of these for us. And for the jumbo, remember three autographs per box on average. Super jumbo, which is coming up later tonight, has five. The first request I've ever heard for Arnold Schwarzenegger stuff. Oh, is that what she wanted? Like that autographs? The sun, yeah. Interesting. The sun wanted? Yeah. Bodybuilding hmm. stuff. I was like, I don't think so. Oh. Yeah. I don't know if they make Schwarzenegger cards like bodybuilding cards. I mean, maybe back in the day. That's an interesting request. I never would have pegged that from that kid. <laughs> that was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And then the next request was Mark Hamill. I was like, we have some, you know, Star Wars stuff. Yeah, Star Wars stuff. That that, yeah. that makes more sense. Yeah. You can buy some of those 8x10s, maybe. So you wanted a Yeah. He did. Oh. Interesting. What? Yeah, I, I didn't peg that you kid. You said it was for his friend, so I don't know. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully there's not much. And they're watching stream. the stream right now, and they're like, those I, guys are I jerks. I tell some people not to watch the stream. Sorry. We're just having fun here. Watching Bowman Draft. <laughs> right. Jumbo QIT 5, 4. Alright, so that Obsidian is sold out, by the way, so we're going to fit that into the schedule here. Stacking the next two also. Oh, nice. So maybe we'll have time to do one minutes. more thing. Eight o'clock. Unless someone comes in, obviously. Distract. All right. So I time. think, unless we're running ahead of schedule, I think we're kind of full for the night. We may be able to squeeze in something short after the obsidian, but we'll play that by ear. But for now, I think we're kind of full. So there's a schedule in the chat, folks. Thank you. We'll try to breeze through this as quickly as possible. These are facsimile autographs, by the way. That's why I'm breezing by those. Um, all paper does not ship. All chrome does ship. Paper numbered cards, of course, will ship. These paper base will get donated to good causes. What time's your last eBay, Jason? The kids uh, in the neighborhood. There's Will Wilson to 150. Yeah, we can just chase him to push the bottom if it's sell or something. I don't know, though. It's his Friday. Right. I don't make him do that. Corey Lee to 250. And our first autograph is Kendall Williams. 111 out of 150. That's for the Bluebirds. That'll be for Chris Parent. 
Kendall Jenner. Williams, that is. Do you think he gets made fun of? I don't think so. They're like, oh, Kendall Jenner. No? Kids are mean. They'll probably do that. Yeah, I'm a professional ball player. <laughs> yeah, all right, that's true. That's a good, that's a good counter. Kendall Jenner is a billionaire. And if I'm, if I'm heckling, I'd be like, Kendall, Kendall Jenner. She's a billionaire. You know, like, uh, get, get me a pair of those Adidas Falcons. Quote, unquote, Kendall self, Jenner. Self-made, she was in, or no, maybe Kylie was. She was in the self-made billionaire category and people were upset. Why were they upset? Because they don't think she's self-made. What is that? Like, didn't inherit money or whatever. You know, started from scratch. They didn't inherit money. Yeah, they're just famous. That's all. Yeah, but they're they got fa they got money because, you know, their parents are famous. Yeah. That's the only reason why she's because of Robert Kardashian. Yeah, and Kim, well, and her I'm sister. Her too. Yeah, I mean, I guess, but it's not like they were billionaires though. They were just rich. <laughs> I, what I'm saying is, Kim built the empire, but then all these other. People oh, because Kim off built the empire. Yeah. Oh, I see. I see. You know, because of that. That thing that I mean, she did, you know. That I know. That yeah. launched it. I suppose so, but. I mean, yeah. I mean, it's not. It's not like. I'd rather put like a tech inventor. It's in not there, like. You know? the, it's not like her younger sisters just just like sat on their butts and were just like, oh, all of a sudden this money started rolling in. They might. They still have to work. Mm. They still have to be semi-professional at mm. like photo shoots and. Modeling gigs? No, you think they just Kylie just walks out there and I think modeling is really easy. <laughs> That's tough. If you're the like Kylie Jenner, I don't know. All the models that I've dated were have always have all <laughs> said that what have all have all had pretty tough lives. <laughs> <laughs> you like that? We I got, think probably for most models, but like Greg Joe, oh, I, I guess if Kylie you're on that Jenner. tier, yeah, the superstar tier. Yeah. All the models that. Are watching this are going to be offended. Yeah, sorry, models that are watching Bowman Draft Jumbo Figure Team Number Four. They're like, oh, Jassies. Misogynistic. Just a bunch of misogynists. That, yeah, we're never watching Bowman Draft on their channel ever again. The other breaks will watch, but not Bowman. Oh, yeah, the other <laughs> breaks. Just not these draft okay, breaks. Okay, Bears score, tying the game up. I like that. Imagine if Allen Robinson had good quarterbacks on him and not like Bortles and Trubisky. All those receivers, like yeah. Allen Robinson and, and Riley Ridley's just being wasted but, out there. And but Allen Robinson had that'll ship to four ninety. Had great years in Jacksonville with no quarterback and good years in Chicago. So yeah, that's true. Imagine Allen Robinson. Imagine Allen Robinson on the Packers. I would think models Aaron like the Rogers. Super Jumbo more. You know. Is it? More, is it? Is it more fashionable? I suppose so. Just up there lean more. I have no idea though. I'm not a model. Not yet. Dare to dream. Orange? We got orange. It's a little blood orange lately. One out of 25. Tommy Henry. Orange paper. And your autograph is an orange team. Whoa. Adley Rushman. Nice. Refractor Auto. 124 out of 499 for the Orioles. Ken Goldberg. Ken Goldberg. With the O's. Yeah. Nice one. I wish it was gold. Yeah, that'd be And I'd cool. be like, hey, gold for Goldberg. It's still nice, though. Number one overall pick in the 2019 MLB Draft. My dad loves that Switch TV hitter. Show. And uh, name nickname Clutchman. He's got a good nickname. He's supposed to be the real deal. Big fan of that show. What? Really? Yeah, he is. Because hmm. I think it's set in, like, Philly. Gotcha. What show? The Goldbergs? Oh, I heard it's funny. Yeah. And we will do and an autograph kid, recap I've seen the kid the before who stars in it. He lives around here. He's in Mickey's all the time. I've seen him in Mickey's. Wow. Tyler Stumpf reporting yeah. that the out of the out of four ninety nine sold for 875 bucks just yesterday. Yeah, that's a good hit. He's out selling everyone else by a lot. He's supposed to be the real deal. He's legit. All right, so we'll grab the next sort of stack right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this there and put this here. And the next autograph is Michael Toglia to 150, 009 out of 150. I knew a kid named Foglia. Not Toglia. We'll set actually we'll set all these autographs right here. So at the at the end there should be 
8 times 3, 24 autos. Sure. Carry the one. That's for the Rockies. That goes to Tyler, who won that spot in the team random. UCLA guy. Move the decimal to times the There you go. Went to UCLA. Should go see more UCLA baseball games. No? College the baseball kind of. Field. College baseball kind of boring, I guess. Jackie Robinson Field. Where do they do the College World Series again? Omaha. 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 I think Teddy stayed there one night. In Omaha? Yeah, in Tulsa. And Santa Fe and Flagstaff. Wait, did he drive out here? Yeah. He had to drive all his stuff out. He's, he's committed then. He's really... The yeah. He's like, no no more New York winters for him. Although I think he said he paid $35 for a Flagstaff motel because he liked it, like, you know, it looked like a cool motel. Uh huh. But then it had roaches in it and stuff. Box yeah. topper! Box topper! Wow. Box topper! My first box topper. I got one yesterday. It was, uh. Oh, uh, you did? Bled, bled Day, I think. It was the box topper. You know who, you know who, they're not dead, okay. <laughs> you know, that's, that caught me off guard, that was pretty funny. Um, those guys are great. Um, you know who loves shipping those box toppers? The boss man loves shipping those. That's his favorite thing. He's just like, oh, he I wish. some off people one time. He's like, he's want. like, he's like, man, I, I wish there were more box toppers and products. All right. There's John Dox, Dox Akis. For the Tampa Bay Rays, that'll be for Jeff Goldberg. I had to block them because they kept running their site on my Instagram feed. <laughs> do they really? On Jaspi. Why would they do that? It's kind of a. Aren't they big enough already? Mm, I, I guess. Don't talk about it. If they were big enough already. They wouldn't have to do that. So they just proved who the who the big D on campus is. Dak. <laughs> yep. All right. Yes, Jonathan, Ken, we will eventually sell out 6 through 10 so we can find you some yeah, red socks. Dakota Prescott sounds like an adult film star name. Not sure if... Uh... Dakota? Yeah. <laughs> That's watching. Dak's real name. Is it really? Yeah, Dakota. I thought it was Dakenzie. I'm kidding. I didn't think that. I knew it was Dakota. Do you think it's named after South Dakota or North Dakota? Um, north. Oh, wait, no. Or the star belt. Riley Green to 99. Green Green's paper. That'll be for the He's Tigers. Darren McKenzie. The Speaking of McKenzie. Draft. I'm sorry, what? Riley Green, fifth overall pick. He is. Good player. Good fundamentals. What's your scouting grade on him on the, on the 40 through 80 scale? Uh, probably a 69. Nice. Nice. All right. There you go. Rich says probably North because North sucks. North Dakota does North Dakota suck. Does North Dakota have the produce uh, Carson Wentz? Yeah, produce Carson Wentz. And uh, doesn't it have uh, the and that guy in the town. The maybe? guys. What about what about the uh, the big statues? Oh, yeah, Rushmore is Rushmore. No, that's South Dakota. Is that South Dakota? Yeah, that's. Uh, There's Isaiah Gillum. Far Fargo. No, that's North. Oh, man, Rich is from South Dakota. He's like, oh, gotcha. What are those? What are those Northerners like, Rich? Like, what's the difference? Are they just a bunch of uh, uncultured brats up there in northern North Dakota? All right, guys, we gotta sell the program next week. Maybe they are. I want to go to Mount Rushmore. I want to check it out. Yeah, but, yeah, what do you, else do you do there? Hike and stuff? Yeah, I guess just hike. Okay. Visit Rich? Yeah. Schmidt. Yeah. No, Rich is in Pennsylvania now. Oh, that's right, yeah. Logan Wyatt with the Giants. Calvin with that one. I mean, I guess Rich and I could go there. Rich, you want to go to South Dakota? Go give to, us a tour. Give us a tour. of. We'll, we'll break on top of Mount Rushmore and then go check out the Declaration of Independence hidden in there. Oh, yeah. Love those movies. Giants, Calvin, once again. Nicholas Cage is, you know, underappreciated. He's not in enough stuff anymore. 
Him and Brendan Fraser. I don't know what happened. Brendan Fraser got like, I don't know, he got canceled in Hollywood for some reason. There's that video. This is why Hollywood. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, so Ten cool. reasons why Brendan Fraser is no longer cast it, in Hollywood. It shows up on everyone's recommendations. Yeah, it's all it's always there, and then you end up clicking it. And then the first you have to see why you Brendan have to see Fraser. it. And it's like it's Brendan. Like, yeah, and like then the it first. gives you like a bio. Need a bio. It's like yeah. Brendan Fraser was in like, it's like the first Airheads, one. and it's like the first one. Brendan Fraser started Looney Tunes. That's right. Why they don't want to cast yeah. Him. Brendan Fraser made some questionable career decisions and no one wants him. He's not a bankable star anymore. That Looney Tunes movie was awesome. There's uh, Chiron Paris. It's, kind of, it's quite a name right there. 374 out of 499. That's for the Halos. That's going to go to Daryl. Paris. 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 Kenton Paris? Do we have a Kenton? No, we have a Kenton Trin. We have a Paris somewhere. There you go. Silky Defender with pillowy hands and quick feet. Wow. Right, so this could be the Andrew Dean Simmons replacement for your angels. Why replacement? Because he's, he's, not, gonna, he's getting, not getting any younger. Daryl with the angels. John McCall saying that Crazy Horse Monument will be really sweet. Yeah, they're building that too. See, there's, there's another monument there. Two monuments. Big Crazy Horse Monument. Big face. On that. on the side of a mountain, it's supposed to be pretty cool. We should build our own monument. How much yeah, we um, we let's find a mountain first around this area. We just buy the land in South Dakota. Oh oh okay, and put a jaspy. All right. How much does land cost, Rich? For a uh, for a small mountain where we can it's gotta be cheaper than where we can engrave right. something there. It's got to be cheaper than Hermosa Beach. Mount Rushmore is in Keystone, South Dakota. Keystone. Mm, Keystone Sculpture Light. Good zone Keystone Great. Light. Cooper Johnson top. to four ninety nine and Cooper Johnson Chrome. Both of those will ship. Jordan Adams to ninety nine. Yeah, and Rich is saying Crazy Horse is taking like fifty years. I think they planned it out ages ago, and they're like, and they kept, they're literally chipping away at it. You got it, Brian? There's a Crazy Horse. Look, look, look how crazy it is. That looks pretty cool, too. Yeah. So there's a couple things to see. And Rich will... They started 71 years ago. Rich will show us around town. Wow, even longer than that, Rich. 71 years ago. And it's far from completion. Brendan Malone. Why is it far from completion? It's completed as designed. It'll be the world's second tallest statue. After, yes. Statue after the pyramid. Sphinx. Statue of Unity. Sphinx, oh. Of independent activist Sardar Patel. That goes to Calvin in the Diamondbacks. Okay. I know that guy. Big Sardar Patel fan. If he, did, if he was good, I like him. Sardar Patel? Yeah. If he was, big fan of his? If he was friendly and stuff. I think the biggest statues were the big statues on that one river in no, Lord, of the Ring. Unity. Lord of the Rings. Oh, okay. Oh, and a golem? <laughs> There's no statue of Gollum. No one likes no one likes Gollum. Is he bad or good? He's yeah, questionable. What? Oh, he's like Jar Jar, where they don't know. <laughs> they don't know. I mean, I mean, is he is he is his soul good? But maybe he was just turned by the One Ring and made bad. Don't spoil it. Well, everyone knows. Can't drink water in me. Why yeah, hold on. Why can't we get Crazy Horse done, Rich? What does it say? Why can't we get this done? What's what's the problem here? But it's it's honoring a Native Native American heritage. Nick Quintana to four nine. But I mean, okay, the the moon's far away. We got there in like a decade. Tell me we can't finish like a stone statue? Get some people out there. They need money, that's why. Oh, is that what it is? John said the same thing. John says it's a money thing. Well, how much how much more money do we need? Let's raise some money for this crazy horse. Is it just one guy with a chisel and hammer? And out of five, Jonathan Ornelas. 
Five out of five red paper. Just one guy, clink, he's, clink, clink. He's like, honey, I gotta, get, I gotta do the one eyelash this week. I gotta do an eyelash this yeah. week. <laughs> oh, he's just all like rigged up. Yeah, he's yeah. Got, got like all these cables and he's just like, clink, clink. <laughs> Texas Rangers, Josh Proust, red paper. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo-hoo. <laughs> John says the guys that are started are getting old. Oh, we got to get this done before they, they pass away. I'm going to go out there, set up a table with a little coffee tin, get some change from everybody. Let's... It's like save the clock tower and back to the future. We're gonna save Crazy Horse. Not save it, but get it get it on track. We'll do group breaks from out there too. Probably really peaceful, beautiful out there. And another orange coming up. Love these oranges, Joey Bart. Twenty five out of twenty five. We may be coming up on a on a golden age of catchers, perhaps young catchers. Will Smith for the Dodgers. Hebert Ruiz, Joey Bart, Adley Rushman. We have a lot of incredible shortstops in baseball. And now maybe maybe a new era of catchers coming up the ranks. I guess he did, yeah. Okay. I just I there was an extra point off to the side. Let's save let's save Crazy Horse. I'm gonna figure out a way. How much more money do they need for that statue? Let's figure it out. A billion doesn't cost a billion dollars to make a statue. There's Brandon Williamson for the Mariners. That will be for Levi. We've got the Mariners in a team random. And once again, we will do a autograph recap at the end of the break. We got Grant McRae, purple chrome to 250. Green paper to 99, Spencer Steer. This Amazon commercial, this little girl is asking, how does how come no one's telling her how things work? I know, it's just like, just someone tell the kid how it works. Everyone's just ignoring her. No, I've not. Is it good? Do we got Mandalorian tonight? Mandalorian tonight, midnight. Right. Yeah, we Woo! Do. I gotta take a nap. Yeah, that. take a nap. Mandalorian. Downton Abbey? Downton oh, Abbey, yes. Yeah. Downton Abbey. Did you see the movie? I heard the movie is not good. No, I've only seen the shows. My grandma saw the movie. She liked it. No, oh, really grandma would like it. Tonight, Josh Wolf. What does that mean? <laughs> I'm really, I'm it's really the, the demographics of that show is not really like... Ooh, not, not really our, our age, no, really. Josh Wolf, five. Metropolitans for Austin. What are you trying to say? That's Houston hmm. It's a show grandmas would definitely love. I'm only the first season ever married. She's something else. <laughs> Don't spoil it. Beyond the Eight. Didn't that show come out like 10 years ago or anything? I don't know. I 
think so. It's been going on for a little bit. Yeah, there you go, John. Why don't we put Amazon on on Crazy Horse? I'll bet if we if I bet we can do it. I bet Amazon can do it. There's Nick Quintana for the Tigers. That's going to be for Darren McKenzie, who got that spot in a team random out of 150. Blue Wave, 90 out of 150. Oh, you want to snap a pick the old ad? Ads? Don't lose it. No, we would not do Ken like that. Maybe Joe P or something. Whoa! <laughs> I'll let Joe P. I don't know. He would never get this hit. I got a check really quick, Chase. Hold on one second. All right. He doesn't get good hits at Jazz. No, he never does. Except for the Chris Bryant logo, man. But that was years ago. Let me get this really quick. And he hit the Bryce Harper, Chris Bryant dual logo, man. I forgot about that one. Back in the queue. All right. <laughs> John, you hear that uh, Bezos from Amazon wants to uh, wants to buy a professional sports team. Oh, that's a big run by Ezekiel Elliott. These these are not numbered, but those those speckles will ship. By the Chargers, moving back to San Diego. JJ Goss to 250. I don't know. This Spanos family is. It's pretty. They're pretty. Pretty stubborn dudes. Pretty pretty stubborn family. And we've got Josh Mears. Going to Brian Peoples and the Padres. Last spot, Mojo. And you can see on the, the Nick cam above my head, big stack of cards right here. That's what we have left. Josh Mears, Padres, speaking of San Diego. Nice. So, folks, this is Jumbo Pick Your Team 4, Jumbo PYT 5 coming up directly after this. And the rest of this is just paper right here. Let's get this next stack over here. There's Davis Wenzel to 250, purple paper. Josh Proust, what's going on? Josh needs a Josh. A Josh Young auto. Jung, Young, Youngian. Theories, philosophies. And the autograph is for the Red Sox. Cameron Cannon. Kaboom. That goes to Jeff and the Red Sox. Wow, Brett Maher missed that kick. I guess it's windy out there today, I think. Uh, yeah, Rory, we got uh, Adley Rushman. That was a big hit. A refractor Adley Rushman. So that was a four ninety nine. Among others.
Facsimile autograph. Another stack Steve over here going. Prism Blaster though, Boston Celtics. But that remains to be seen only because. Um, Got a couple stacks out here. Customer still has. Almost done, boys and girls. And then we've got another jumbo coming up nice. right after this. And then it looks like we've got Obsidian football after that. And that should bring us to. A good stopping point. I think we'll be done after after that. That should bring us right to the end of the stream. Okay. So everything else will break yeah, tomorrow. There's Brandon Lewis to 150. And we've got a... Jared Triolo, 52 out of 71. Speckle Auto for the Pirates. That goes to Matt Sims. Phil Sims' kid. Is that Phil Sims' kid? Yeah. Nice. There you go. Has interesting business career after baseball. There you go. That's kind of vague. <laughs> I'm gonna do something in business. Interested in making money after. Yeah, interested in making money after pro career is over. Okay. Interested in breathing. Yeah. <laughs> interested in a life after baseball. <laughs> There's Ryan Garcia to four ninety nine paper. Seth Beer, mmm, beer. Wait, Seth Beer's on the uh, Diamondbacks now? Was he on the Astros? Yeah, I guess so. Seth Beer got traded. Yeah, he was drafted. He was a first round pick by the Astros in 2018. Oh, it was the Granky deal? Right. Supposed to be a pretty solid player, actually. He was in the, yeah, John Alfie saying he was in the Granky deal. Yeah, there you go. Thanks, John. It's like, wait a second, Seth Beer in a Diamondbacks uniform. Trading Fletcher to 499. Blue paper, Ryan Garcia to 150 for the Rangers. I'll take a first round, first round hitter. Late first round hitter for Zach Granke. And we've got Jake Sanford. 44 out of 250 purple chrome autograph for Junior and the Yankees. When's this guy coming up? Mackenzie Gore. He was he was a got drafted in 2017, third overall. Maybe this year. song singing so by the way these are not number that's why I've been breezing by these no number
And look at this. Nice. Greg Jones for the Rays. Class of 2019 insert auto. 19 out of 50. That's pretty cool. That's a good looking card for the Rays. That's going to go to Jeff Goldberg in Tampa Bay. There he is. Nice Greg Jones. We got Sixto Sanchez, 250, purple paper for the Marlins. Marlins, who reconfigured their outfield a little bit. I think they put some turf out there, and they brought in the walls. Maybe less doubles, less triples, more home runs, I guess is what they're looking for. New Ranger Stadium is opening up, too. I just saw this on MLB Network earlier today. The Ranger Stadium, they have the dimensions um, of the stadium all based off of historical numbers. For example, the distance between home plate and the back wall, 42 feet for Jackie Robinson. I think there's the, the, the left field wall, I think is like Adrian Beltre's career batting average, like 331 or something like that, down the left field line. Where he played third base for so long, so and other numbers too, which I thought was pretty cool. I thought that was a cool way of of doing field dimensions. Oh, Hunter Bishop, purple refractor, Re redemption popping out here. Hunter Bishop is a gi giant. Tenth overall pick, San Francisco Giants. This is the way. This is the way. This is the way. Yeah. Yeah, come come to the shop, get your baby Yoda Funkos, ladies and gentlemen. I mean, Ovs. I will too. They have 10 inch ones, sorry. And then they have the normal ones. How tall are the normal ones? Because I got to fit it on top of here. Okay. All the other Star Wars guys. Are you going to take it out of the case? No, I'm just going to leave it in the box. Yeah. All those guys need some need a baby Yoda in their lives. Okay, I got to get some for the holiday season. Right, right, right. Yeah. If we're the one shop in town without baby Yodas, we're going out of business. Yeah. Going out of business. Then it'll be like one star review. Jaspies does not have baby Yoda. With all the Star Wars talk that they have, no baby Yodas. Jaspies canceled. I'll be honest though, I think the guys are kind of soft. The Mandalorian guy. Like, what? Kind of soft. Why? I don't know. A true Mandalorian <laughs> wouldn't <laughs> waste his time with well, that kid. People think he's not a true Mandalorian. Well, he's not. He was raised by Mandalorians. But he's not. A true Mandalorian. Is that like Disney? Like, no, that's what they said in the show. That was the big reveal in chapter. Dude, he's a foundling, dude. He doesn't even have a child. Baby Yodas at Jaspies, fourteen oh two Pacific Coast Highway. Out of two fifty, Spencer Brickhouse. She's a brick house. That's the lyrics. Yeah, she's a brick house, and that's uh, Spencer's last name. To two fifty, going to the Diamondback, Calvin Chang. There's a website called 
forget. I think it's called kissedthisguy.com. Yeah, there it is. Where people thought uh, that Jimi Hendrix song. There's Joey Bart to 150. I like that Atomic Refractor. And Jake Sanford to 499 for the Yankees. That goes to Junior. I think it was kissthisguy.com where, where that Jimi Hendrix song where he goes, Excuse me while I kiss the sky. Purple haze all in my eyes. But people thought it, some people heard it as kiss this guy, not kiss the sky. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. It just, Jimi Hendrix? I didn't need show Prince to shut up to your house. I've been on Lights and Music by Cut Copy. Phase. Cut Copy is great. L Lights and Music. That That's drums. great, great track. That. They're, uh, then, uh, they're a Australian production duo. Take Me Over. I think uh, if you like that, you might like the presets who are also from Australia. I think I've heard of them, yeah. My Spotify Unwrapped came, and I think they were one of the top ones. Spotify. We need Spotify to sponsor us. This is break brought to you by Spotify. Join now. Uh, I'm a Spotify guy. Whoa! Maybe we should be part of. Maybe part of Jason's family. Spotify, I got, I, can have one more. I got a free Google Home from Spotify. So Whoa! I paid for my whole membership. Whoa! <laughs> Why is there a red light outside of the store? I know, I noticed that too, but I think that's in, that? that's it's intentional. A, it's like a light bulb. Yeah. I don't know why it's red. He bought it red? Well, well someone <laughs> had to intentionally Well, he do always that. likes a red light special, but I don't know what that means. We're on the dark side. Isn't that, uh, aren't those houses of ill repute? No. It's, it's not like oh, that's a red light district. Greg Jones, 121 out of 150. Tampa Bay Rays, another it's raid for Jeff Goldberg. Oh yeah, that was a that was, that, was a, that was a good group, good track. They got Crete, they got Waterfall. Waterfall's a banger. Banger. That's just you just blast that on the streets of L.A. Yeah. One of them like passed away tragically, right? Thinking of, like a car accident or something like that. And I think one of the girls was married to Andre Risen. Wide receiver in Atlanta, I think. No, he didn't. I think there was a domestic dispute, and she maybe she may or may not house may or may not burn down a house, part of a house. <laughs> I'll bet that was. <laughs> yeah, Lisa Lopes. I'll I'll bet like on second thought, she was just like, oh no, <laughs> like she probably felt so she bad. She attempted to turn like, his shoes off fire in the bathtub. Yeah, and there's like, like the whole thing. so there's like, oh no. She got charged with first degree arson. Mm. And she's. Oh, that's what it was. She was driving a Mitsubishi Montero. Tragic. And then, like... She swerved slightly to avoid a truck. Then immediately to the right, she tried to avoid an oncoming car. And then went down a cliff or something like that? It rolled several times after hitting... Out of 150, Cal Mitchell. Two trees. We'll have one more jumbo after this, ladies and gentlemen. C.J. Abram, paper to four ninety nine. That'll go to Brian Peoples. Let's see if we can find his autograph too, Brian. That'd be nice. There's Kyle Stowers stowing away to Ken Goldberg. Sean says, hi, everybody. Anything fun I missed? Well, you missed Transcendent earlier today. You missed the Adley Rushman in this break, among others. It looks cold in Chicago. I'm watching Thursday Night Football, too.
Out of 250, Leonardo Jimenez for the Bluebirds. Got Tim Tebow. Is Tim Tebow ever going to get called up, ladies and gentlemen? So still grinding in the minors. Here's Mackenzie Gore to 150. I don't know when he's going to get called up. Soon, though, he was a pretty high pick a couple years ago. Is he out of high school? If he's out of high school, maybe it'll take a little bit longer. I just grabbed the one that was on inside, so the outside, but that's hmm. right. Don't know. But we'll see. He's one of their big pitching prospects. All right. A couple more stacks to go right here, ladies and gentlemen. And then another jumbo break. Oh, and I forget to keep bringing that box hopper. We'll do that box hopper, too. We got Jared Triolo, 197 out of 499. Another, another pirate for Matthew Sims. The temperature here in this building is a little rough. Uh, actually, it might be us because no one else has anything. <laughs> you think our just. I don't know. Our, our, our body temperature is just off? I guess. Maybe we just we just complain about it more. Yeah. I'm pretty low maintenance, but the temp it's only temperature. temperature. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, just, it's weird. I don't like temperature. I don't like that red light either. That red light. I thought it was, I thought it was, like, last night it kind of surprised me. I was like, what is that? I thought something was wrong. And then I was like, oh, it's not. There's Matt Gorski, 499 paper. Oh, the Bears are in the red zone again? Third and goal? Touchdown. Nice catch. Fumble? Whoa, Jalen Smith. Yeah. It. yeah, but how does Jalen Smith have it now? Wait, what does he have it? It's like that Seahawks Packer team that one year. That's a that's a touchdown. Yeah, he's already got the catch and he's on the ground. Oh, and there is, what's he writing here? There's Grant McRae, CM90, GM, GM90. He got, you got a little inscription right here. Grant McRae, GM, or 40, maybe his number is 40. Is that his like Twitter handle? I wonder if he did that for all the cards or just this one. Giants, that'll be go, that'll go to Calvin. All right, guys. Got to look that up, Calvin. So four cards per pack, six packs per box. 24 total cards and 20 boxes. Ooh, and a printing plate. Thomas Dillard for the Brew Crew. That goes to John Alfie's and the Brewers. There you go, John. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. These are on all his autos, Tyler is saying. R must have gotten tired at some point.
All right, that's the last stack right there, and then the, we'll do the box topper. Good luck, everybody. Are the box topper the autograph or something? They could be, I think. I think they only fall like one every other case or one every few cases or something like that. Yeah, Tyler's saying that he's seen that GM40 on, on all the ones he's seen thus far. There's Kyle McCann to 99, green paper. A's, that's for Josh Plemons. Yeah, I guess he's just yeah trying to get those followers. He's like, this is a, this is a good branding exercise for me. And we got Tyler Callahan. Tyler Callahan. That reminds me of, uh, you know what that reminds me of? That reminds me of Harry Callahan. You guys remember Harry Callahan? Who remembers Harry Callahan? Let's do Tyler Callahan. Reminds me of, spelled differently, I think, but... There's Mackenzie Gore again to 499. It's Ryan. It's all paper right here. Old Harry Callahan. Patrick K remembers Callahan Auto Parts. I remember, I remember O'Reilly Auto Parts, 250, Christian Robinson, purple paper for Calvin. Oh, 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 O'Reilly. Callahan was from Tommy Boy. There's a Callahan there, Harry Callahan. There's another Harry Callahan, Sean. I know what you're thinking. Do you fire six shots? Or only five. I'll tell you the truth. And all this excitement. Kind of lost track myself. 39 out of 99, Matthew Allen. Mets. There's Dre Jameson. Mmm, Jameson. And the last bit here is gonna be, ooh, a dual on-card autograph for the Marlins. That's, what a way to finish the break. That's number 29 out of 50. Chris Bonewell, who got the Marlins in a team random, lands this one. On one side is J.J. Blade and Cameron Meisner on the right side. That's a big prospect right there. That's pretty strong. That's a great way to end it, ladies and gentlemen. Very nice hit. I guess Chris was feeling lucky. All right, let's see what this box topper has for us. And it's another top prospect right here. I think these are all top tens right here. Nick Lodolo for the Reds. Not autographed, but that's numbered one out of 99. And that'll be for Daryl and the Red Legs. No, seventh overall right there. There you go.
There you have it, boys and girls. Let's do a quick recap. Got the duel right here. Got the printing plate. We got the nice Hunter Bishop for the Giants. I like these class of 2019 insert autos. Some speckle. Some Adley Rushman right there was pretty nice. That Adley Rushman was to $4.99, by the way. Probably a thousand dollar card right there. Some nice color, five out of five paper. Got a train whistle in the break. We've got some Docs, some Toglia, some Jones, and Kendall Williams Blue Wave. Which started the whole Kendall Jenner conversation at the beginning of the break. There you have it. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for breaking with us. We'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.